your name? Ed Edward Carmichael. <laughs> Haven't done anything. You had it, huh? This seems rather high-handed to me. What's it all about? Department of Justice. Oh, my goodness, Jamin! Ed, what have you done? Haven't done anything. What's the boy done, officer? What is it? What's I told you the cellar. Oh, yes, yes, it does. Yes, Mac. Jim? Yes, sir. Go downstairs. See what you can find. Yes, sir. I haven't done anything. Come here, you. Yeah. Recognize these? Yes, sir. They're my circulars. You print this stuff, huh? Yes, sir. And you put them in a box of candy and get them into people's houses? I love dreams. Oh. It mean anything. You didn't, eh? Dynamite the Capitol, dynamite the White House, dynamite the Supreme Court. God is the state, the state is God. Oh, but I didn't mean that. I just like to print, don't I, Grandpa? The government's in no danger from it. Well, printing is just his hobby, that's all. He prints anything. Yeah. <laughs> I've never heard of such nonsense. Listen, I refuse to stand here. Let me go back down get my butt. Shut up. Oh. You were right, Chief. Gunpowder down there to blow the whole city to hell. Oh, no! I'm still in the Everybody in this house is under arrest! Oh, no! You don't understand! Sheriff, all of you! You don't understand! You don't understand! I have to hear you! Who's that? That's my mother! Oh, my... Oh, careful! Line up all of you! Okay, Jen, what kind of part do you play, and who is it? Um, I play Mrs. Kirby, and she's sort of a stuffy, uh, rich lady. I'm Mr. Kirby's wife, as you can probably tell. And um, we are opposed to Alice marrying Tony because we don't want him under um, the strange influence of their family. Okay. I'm James Mattis, and I'm a junior, 11th grade. James, what kind of character do you play? And I noticed that your outfit's really spiffy. What does this indicate? Well, I play the aristocratic snob in the play. I'm the... Uh, son, I mean the father of Tony who you just interviewed, and I'm opposed to the marriage in the play, and I'm a real snot. Okay, how, how, did, you, how, did, you, how did you take to this character? Did you, did you actually sign up for the character, or how were you cast? No, I'd originally tried out, I was wanting to try out for another part, but uh, teacher had me read for this, she liked it, and that was it. I'm Kirsten Lee Jensen, and I'm a senior, and I play Gay Wellington. Aries. <laughs> how, how many, is this your first play, then, you're in here? Yes, it is. Thanks a lot. Thank you. We're speaking with Jason Wells. Yeah, Jason, what grade are you in? I'm in 11th grade at Los Angeles High School. Uh, I play a G-man, and my, my name's Mac, and uh, I'm probably in for about a whole total of five minutes. And I'm in the 10th grade, my name is Matthew McShee. Exactly what time, how much time goes into putting on your makeup and your costumes? For me, I'd say about 10 minutes. I'm Pam Spires, and I'm a junior. So that you're assistant director. Could you explain what kind of responsibilities you have as a, in that post? Um, well, I prompted them, and basically it's running errands, getting things together. I help out. I did makeup. I do everything. I do a little bit, yeah. I do a little bit of everything. How much time did this take again, did, the four weeks that everybody else, or did it take a little bit more time to coordinate activities? No, actually, I was working on it for two weeks. I see. And I did more hours than they did. I did set building and stuff, so. I see. I'm Mickey Arang, and I'm in 11th grade. Okay, Mickey was, uh, Mickey, could you explain what you were doing earlier to the show? Oh, I'm the makeup artist. My makeup so. artist. <laughs> That's all I do. What basically does that involve? Like, there's about three makeup artists. She does it well. well. 